welcome to my channel it's your girl Anu how are you guys all doing I hope you guys are all good I know I keep burdening you guys with all this work but I'm sure you guys love it today's video is going to be a misguided one so misguided has been absolutely killing it at the moment I kind of have a collection of things that I want to show you guys I have a bunch of everything the whole shebang bang so if you guys want to see what I picked up from Misguided. Stay tuned. But before we get started with the video, subscribe to my channel if you're not already subscribed. Click the subscribe button anywhere on the screen because it changes all the time. It's somewhere. Click the subscribe button and also turn on your post notifications so that you are notified every single time I upload a video because it's about to be next level up in this ish. Without any further ado, let's get into this video already opened because patience when it comes to fashion is something that I really really struggle with so I had to so I picked up a few things from the Playboy X misguided collaboration that was like a couple of weeks ago um, it came out the first time so I think this is the second drop first drop everything sold out the whole collection sold out so when they came up with this one this time around i had to run and pick me up some stuff because i was so excited and here i am to show i'm kind of looking at everything that i picked up from the playboy x misguided collection and it's all looking the same so the first item that i have to show is this hoodie it's called the playboy repeat print cropped hoodie i absolutely love this i kind of like this repeated playboy logo that's all over the body i think it's really trendy because playboy can kind of be a little bit outdated i'm glad that they brought this to 2018. i really like this so it's a cropped hoodie i kind of loved everything that they had in this color from this collection i thought it was absolutely amazing it's quite short and I'm kind of liking this drawstring here but what I kind of plan to do with this is to take off the hoodie I'm not really a hoodie fan but I like hoodies but it has to be a certain way I kind of realize every time I buy cropped hoodies I don't wear them and I don't know I think I just generally don't like cropped hoodies so what I plan to do with this is to cut out the hood and just have it like this I picked the crop top up in a size 14 because I kind of wanted it to be oversized and big you know I love my baggy stuff I wanted it to be oversized and free and kind of loose I kind of like that style I bought this with the matching joggers and that's it right there I'm not really a joggers girl but I'm looking to try new things so I thought I'd buy this like joggers for me are things that I just wear to lounge around the house but this is an real excuse to wear it outside the color is really gorgeous and also that print again this is the playboy pit print slim jogger and i got this in a size 12. i really like this a lot i like that it's got the cuff on the bottom of the leg as well to kind of cinch it in this kind of runs a little bit big i wish i got this in a size 10 because it's quite on the bigger side but you know what i don't mind it it would do it's not bad i just wish i got it in a size down because it runs a little bit big and i'm really sorry guys but i think this may be sold out online again i'll try and find the link and put it in the description box below so definitely check the description box out what i noticed when i was shopping on with Skydage was that every time i typed in playboy x misguided on the app or online on the website it wouldn't go through because it would just say no results found i don't know why but i already had some of the stuff saved in my basket and i clicked on it and it showed but when you physically go in to type it into the search engine on the search box on the misguided app or website it tells you there's no result i don't really know why that is i don't really know what's happening so um, misguided help us out please help us out yeah so this is just nice joggers the only thing is they don't have any pockets which i kind of wish they did because sometimes when i'm wearing clothes i kind of don't know what to do with my hands especially when i'm wearing baggy clothes i feel like i need to put my hands in my pocket and you know i just feel like my hands need to be in a pocket but these don't have any which is kind of annoying these are very well made like the quality is actually impeccable really gorgeous again i love this color don't have much to say about these joggers, I love them. Sticking to the same theme, I got me a pair of cycling shorts. I'm trying new things 
for a very long time i was not a fan of the cycling shorts trend i was just like oh what <laughs> that looks like underwear <laughs> why am i going to be stepping out of my house in something that looks like underwear no but i'm kind of catching on slowly and i think i like this again i got the cycling shorts to go with t-shirts this is an oversized t-shirt and the label of this is gone but i'm guessing it's called the playboy repeat print t-shirt because everything is called repeat print and i bought this with the cycling shorts because i saw it here together on juliet fox her style is just eclectic and beautiful and so when i saw her wearing this i was like where is it where is it i love that combo together and it's really really gilt style that with trainers style it with a jacket you're good to go and i know it's kind of cool to be wearing cycling shorts but trust me you can't make it work i got the cycling shorts in a size 12 but i feel like i could have gone down to a size 10. i think i have what you call body dysmorphia where i feel like i'm bigger than i actually am so i got this it fits nice i just think i could have done with getting this in a size 10 to kind of give that snug look i got the t-shirt in a size 12 because i wanted it to be oversized it's already like an oversized fit so i think the size 12 was kind of perfect because i didn't want it to look too baggy especially if i'm going to be styling it with a coat I'm sticking with the same color palette i got a bodysuit this is the scoop neck bodysuit and i plan to wear this with the joggers i'm really sorry guys but i don't remember the prices of any of this stuff i will leave all the links down below and if i can also put in the prices in the description i will do that for you guys but yeah that's just this bodysuit it's a long sleeve bodysuit quite basic style it with the joggers and you know bob's your uncle the bodysuit comes in a thong style there's nothing worse than getting bodysuit that give you major vpl and also it comes in a proper style which is okay perfect i've had this camo trousers for a few months when the whole camo trend was on fire for god like when everybody was wearing camo trousers i thought it would be a good idea to get these and i absolutely love them so much i really think they're really nice i got this in a size 12 and these are so big or maybe it's not me maybe it's misguided and their sizing i don't know these i got this in a size 12 and these are so big on the waist they fit me perfectly on the thighs and the legs and everything i like the fit it's a bit baggy but i kind of like that look it's just the waist the waist is like a bucket waist honestly the waist is so wide it's an actual joke so what i will do is wear it and get it taken in on the waist i'm probably just going to put like two darts here just to make it fit a little bit better you know i mean all the stuff i'm showing you guys are almost kind of like basic stuff there isn't much to say about them i'm just they're just items that i'm showing and i know i'm a bit late showing this but uh she gonna do it anyway she gonna do it do it do it for y'all i got the bodysuit i'm wearing in the cutaway from pretty little thing and i thought it was perfect it goes with this really nice i like the style of it i like that it's brown and i would style this with like heels or some kind of low shoes I, do. I wouldn't really start this with boots because it's a bit too Annie-esque for my liking like I'm not about to go and fight in the war so we're not gonna do that I got me this nice camo crop top funny story of why I got this is I don't really celebrate Halloween but I was feeling like if I would celebrate Halloween or if I wanted to celebrate Halloween I wanted to go for like a survival girl look you know the 90s destiny's child survival look i kind of like this camo look and this would definitely go really nice in the summertime just both of them together with some nice cute shoes this crop top guys was only three pounds this guy did was playing games i think there must have been a glitch this was three pounds three pounds this was three pounds and on the day when i bought this there were other things on the site that were like three pounds i saw this really gorgeous gold dress that was three pounds but somebody grabbed it before i could i don't know if you guys scour enough or misguided through the sales section you will find good beautiful items on there for three pounds i don't know what it is that they do at misguided but they have a lot of things on there that are three pounds at like irregular times like they don't announce it they don't put it out there they just reduce it and the people who know know before I forget, this bodysuit that I'm wearing, this burgundy one, also is from Misguided. And I liked it, it was just a cute little basic bodysuit with a v-neck. My only issue with this bodysuit is it's very low. 
I didn't do the clasp at the bottom. I just tucked it in. If I did the clasp, honestly, it would be... <laughs> the way this is designed, it's like, honestly, if I wore this how it's supposed to be worn, like, it would literally have... No. My mom would nearly have a heart attack. No. It's really nice. It's very comfortable. I just think it's a little bit too expose. It's too low, like misguided. Some of us actually want to dress a little bit more modest. Like I'm not saying I want a turtleneck, but, but it's a really nice body too. I like the color of it and yeah, that's that. If you guys watched my Primark haul, you would have seen a running thing with my color choice. So burnt orange, dark brown, and anything along that color palette, I absolutely love at the moment. If you also saw in that in that video, I had some leggings I was wearing, and these are them right here, and these were also from Misguided. You guys should know why I bought this. I only bought it because it was orange. I... Yes, and I have a coat that this would go so well with. I cannot wait to wear it somewhere. Like that's why I bought this. I was looking for like orange leggings to go with this coat i absolutely love this leggings this leggings are so perfect it's got this thick band on the waist and that thick band helps you to suck in all the food baby suck in the food bar suck it all in and i love this leggings because of that it's a really well made pair of leggings they're really nice they're very long as well which is absolutely gorgeous they're high-waisted all the things i love in a legging I love orange, check. I love a high waist, check. I love a high thick band, check. I love it to be nice and long, check. What can I say? Meta. I've got another cargo pant and these are just lovely, 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 lovely denim cargo pants. I like this a lot because this kind of is more of something that I would wear because it's denim. And I like the contrast stitching that it's got there. It's very nice. It's got pockets in the front, which are absolutely lovely. It's got side pockets there, and it's also got pockets behind. But these pockets, I don't think, are like useful. Are they? Oh, they do work. I just like the whole vibe of this. I like that it's got the cuff on the ankle bit there. I really like this a lot. I like the wash of it as well. I think it's a perfect wash for this style. It doesn't make you look too dressed down, but it's like a dressed down look, if that makes any sense yes it makes sense to me the same issues i'm facing with the cargo pants i'm facing with these they fit me perfectly but the waist are ridiculously big absolutely big i picked this up again in size 12 fits perfectly around the legs fits perfectly around the cuff fits perfectly but the waist the waist is a wrap bye bye this guy didn't need to do something about this sizing i don't know i don't, I don't, I don't, I don't know everybody just doesn't want to get my size right so i don't even have a small waist I really like this a lot actually, I really like this a lot. And I got a matching denim jacket to go with this from ASOS. I kind of loving ASOS at the moment. Maybe I should do an ASOS haul. Do you guys want to see an ASOS haul? If you guys want to see an ASOS haul, thumbs up this video and also drop me a comment in the comment section because I have a bunch of stuff that I bought from ASOS and I'm loving ASOS at the moment. ASOS Day. I also picked this up from the Playboy X Misguided collection and it's the Playboy ribbed mini dress. I picked it up in a size 12. It's black. It's kind of coming across a bit dark grey on camera but it's a black dress. It's nothing special to be honest. It's just a basic black dress with the Playboy typo across the middle there. It's very nice actually and this is embroidered on so it's going to be really good. The quality of the dress is quite nice. I have nothing bad to say about it. It's kind of that square neck style that is really on trend at the moment and is everywhere. I probably style it with like a coat, some trainers. Make it look cute, I guess. Make it look cute. It's got adjustable straps so you can make it high, you can make it low. This is a really cute dress. I don't really have anything much to say about it besides she cute and whatever. Well, my birthday is coming up soon and I don't really have any concrete plans yet regarding that. But I was kind of preparing in my head and I bought this nice brown dress. And this is just a soft touch, slinky, sweetheart mini dress. I like this dress a lot. It's off shoulder. It's got the sweetheart neckline that kind of goes like that. And the main reason why I picked this dress up was the color is, whew, wow, wow, they're including us now. Like, we have our own nude. We have a nude dress. 
that is for black people that fits our skin tone that is not a different color to our skin tone oh my god we have a need don't stop making brown clothes for brown girls because we need it i love this dress a lot not much to say about it it's a nice slinky fabric it's kind of got a little bit of everything it's off shoulder sweetheart neckline it's short it's a lot going on but um i'll see how it goes i might wear it i might not i might take it back and i think i also got this in a sale i can't remember how much i paid for it but i think this was part of the sale stuff i'm gonna leave the links to everything i showed in this video in the description box so check that out that's where the magic happens so the last and not the least item that i have to show you is another bodysuit soft touch slinky square neck bodysuit this is just a base i think this haul is kind of full of basic stuff this again is just another simple bodysuit with the square neck i love the square neck detailing like i love square neck on anything and everything maybe i should have got this um, bodysuit in a square neck it was too late to take it back now anyway maybe i'll find one this makes the girls mm, sit up right and juicy and that this makes the boobies look really nice <laughs> really gorgeous long sleeve slinky fabric she's really cute is this thong style oh this guy did okay yes i think this is thong style is it thong style it's got the thong style going down the middle there so it's a really cute bodysuit if i find any more like bodysuits in this i'll buy it i really want a nice brown one that's kind of like this if i find one i will cop it and if you guys know of anywhere where i can find one please leave me a message leave me a comment down below let me know where i can cop this in a brown thank you guys so much for watching this video i hope you guys really enjoyed my picks from misguided do not relax on those three pound sales misguided ain't playing games they ain't telling no one again i will leave all the links to everything i've showed in this video in the description box below i will also leave the sizes down below i'm not really sure about the prices i will just leave links you can just click on it and if you want it but if you don't then peace out don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you're not already subscribed and let's get better acquainted i was kind of thinking of doing a get to know me video on my channel if you guys are interested to see that or if you guys want me to do a get to know me video leave me a comment in the comment section saying get to know me and if i get enough get to know me comments then i will do a get to know me video if not then i'm sorry it's just gonna have to be on to what you guys want to see and i have some hauls coming on soon i have a aliexpress haul coming on soon i have a pretty little thing haul coming on soon i have some lookbooks that i have planned it's coming it's in the works we're getting to it we will get there i hope you guys have enjoyed today um i think that's the end of this video i'll catch you guys in my next one hope you guys have a lovely rest of the day and i'll catch you guys soon Mwah.